Well, as it gets colder, the pandemic is adding yet another obstacle for many families this year. Many people are already struggling to feed their loved ones and pay their bills. So the idea of buying warm clothes for winter has become almost impossible. But as Lindsay Ward explains, that is where a local coat drive comes in. Rows upon rows of jackets, more than a thousand of them have been donated. And this year, because of the pandemic, families are coming in for the first time. All right, this is a great one for dinner. As temperatures continue to dip and people still find themselves out of work. Everybody is just filled with anxiety these days. Many are having to choose between buying food for their families or staying warm. People finally, their the subsidy check has run out. You know, their unemployment is reduced and running out. And it's leading them here at the East End Cooperative Ministry in East Liberty. It's their annual coat drive where people can grab a jacket and other items of clothing for free. We've seen lines out the door every day. No, you go from no, shoulder to shoulder, what do you think? No. Yeah. Eugene Young brought his brother Paul, who lives in a nursing home, into the ministry today. He tells me they needed that extra help. The community looks for this type thing, you know, and if they take it away, you know what I'm saying, it leaves a lot of people without. It's just such a blessing um, to be able to be helpful and um, just to realize that you're making a difference. And the drive will end this Saturday at 1 in the afternoon. Reporting in East Liberty, Lindsay Ward, KDKA News.